Difference between diamond and graphite. Objective. To study structures and properties of diamond and graphite. Diamond and graphite are the two naturally occurring allotropes of carbon. These allotropes differ in many properties. For example, diamond is a hard and shiny substance which does not conduct electricity. On the other hand, graphite is a soft and slippery black colored substance which conducts electricity. The difference in properties arises due to different structures of these allotropes. Structure and Properties of Diamond When an electric current is passed through a diamond, the bulb does not glow. We all know that free electrons are responsible for conduction of current in solids. In diamond, the electronic configuration of carbon is 2, 4. It contains four electrons in its outermost orbit. It shares all the four electrons with four other carbon atoms. So there are no free electrons left in carbon atoms. Thus, diamond is a bad conductor of electricity. When force is applied on a diamond, it does not break. As in a diamond, carbon atoms are bonded by very strong covalent bonds to each other to form a strong tetrahedral structure. When an external force is applied, this rigid network does not allow these atoms to move from their position, and thus diamond can resist the external force. This makes the diamond very hard. In fact, it is the hardest material known to man with a hardness of 10 on the MOS scale. Structure and Properties of Graphite When electric current is passed through a graphite rod, the bulb glows, indicating graphite as a good conductor. In graphite, out of the four valence electrons of carbon, it shares three electrons with three other carbon atoms while one electron remains free. This forms a hexagonal structure. Many such hexagonal structures are arranged one above the other. In graphite, each carbon atom gives one free electron, which remains delocalized between the hexagonal structures. So there are a large number of delocalized electrons free to move between the hexagonal structures. When electricity is passed, these delocalized electrons flow between the hexagonal layers and conduct electricity. Thus, graphite conducts electricity. Graphite is soft and slippery thus used as a good lubricating agent. In graphite, carbon atoms form a hexagonal structure, which are held in different layers. There are weak van der Waals bonds between these layers. When the external force is applied, the van der Waals bonds cannot withstand the force and one layer slides over the other layers. This makes graphite very soft and slippery. Summary We have studied that in diamond, carbon atoms are bonded to form tetrahedral structure, which makes it hard and a bad conductor of electricity. While in graphite, Carbon atoms are bonded to form hexagonal structure, which makes it soft and slippery and a good conductor of electricity.